Now let's take a look at active empathetic listening. When we listen, our behaviors should reflect that we are paying attention to the messages and responding authentically to our conversation partner. We should look like we are paying attention and that we care about this conversation. This involves quieting our own minds in exchange for being fully present in a moment and engaging someone else's messages. Unfortunately, we are not always very good at this, especially during a heated debate or pressing conversation. We have all zoned out when a friend's story goes a little too long, started thinking about the best comeback instead of listening to the other person in an argument, started scrolling through social media while in a conversation, or let our mind wander to a completely different topic when we were bored or thought the topic was irrelevant. When we disengage from a conversation like this, we are doing passive listening. In contrast to this, active empathetic listening is a cognitive and behavioral process that occurs when the listener is engaged and emotionally involved in all three stages of the listening process. In the sensing stage, which includes hearing and understanding, active listeners pay attention to the explicit and implicit messages shared by the speaker, including the words spoken and the emotional context conveyed in nonverbal messages. In the processing stage, which includes remembering and interpreting, active listeners focus on remembering what the speaker says, ask for clarifications when appropriate, and try to put together all of the verbal and nonverbal messages in a coherent, whole message that includes both the informational and emotional context or content. Finally, in responding stage, which includes evaluating and responding, active listeners provide verbal and nonverbal feedback, summarize messages, and ask questions to check for understanding and provide more extended responses.